Hey guys, how are things? Do you want to learn something? If so, better watch and listen. And I need your full attention. Welcome to our lesson in this module, which is problem solving on permutation. In this topic, you are expected to solve problems involving permutations. But before we dig deeper, let's answer first the pretest. Directions. Identify what is being asked in each question. Write your answer in your paper. Number one, Malu owns five different blouses. If she cannot wear the same blouse on two consecutive days, how many different ways can she dress on Wednesday and Thursday? Is it A, B, C, or D? The correct answer is letter D. For number two, Bobby has five, five textbooks on his shelves. If Matt must always be in the middle, how many ways can he arrange the books? A, 24, B, 48, C, 72, and D, 112. The correct answer is letter A. Number three. 20 students join a contest in the school. The contest offers first, second, and third prize. How many different combination of first, second, and third place winners can be there? Is it A, B, C, or D? The answer is letter C. For number four, in how many ways can seats be chosen for 12 couples on a Ferris wheel that has 12 double seats? A, B, C, or D? The correct answer is letter B. And for number five, Rose is planting 11 colored flowers in a line. In how many ways can she plant four red flowers, five yellow flowers, and two purple flowers? Is it A, B, C, or D? The correct answer is letter A. Thank you guys. Your effort in answering the pretest is very much appreciated. Now, let's proceed to the recap. Identify what is being asked in each question. Write your answer in your paper. Write permutation problem whose answer is 6 factorial. Number 2. Right permutation problem whose answer is 6 minus 1 factorial. And number 3, right permutation problem whose answer is 6 factorial divided by 2 factorial. Just write your answer in your notebook and we will check it later. And now, let's proceed to the lesson. Let us try this word problem. Number 1. How many four-letter words, with or without meaning, can be formed out of the letters of the word logarithms if repetition of letters is not allowed? In this kind of problem, we can use permutation, wherein permutation of n taken r is equal to n factorial divided by the quantity of n minus r. So n is equal to 10 and r is equal to 4. So we have Permutation of 10 taken 4 is equal to 10 factorial divided by the quantity of 10 minus 4 factorial, which is 5,040 letter words. Next, number 2. Jervis is organizing sports equipment for the physical education room. He has 15 balls that must be placed in a line. In how many ways can he line up six footballs, two soccer balls, four kickballs, and three basketballs? Using the formula of distinguishable permutation, which is P is equal to N factorial divided by A factorial times B factorial times C factorial times and so on and so forth. So N is 15, which is 15 factorial divided by six factorial for the footballs, 2 factorial for the soccer balls, 4 factorial for the kickballs, and 3 factorial for the basketballs, which is P is equal to 
6,306,300 ways. And for number three, find the number of ways in which five people, Rose, Malu, Sheena, Bobby, and Chris, have placed settings or seats at a circular table such that Bobby and Malu must always sit together. P is equal to the quantity of n minus 1 factorial. But as you can see in the problem that there is a restriction wherein Bobby and Malu wants to sit together and that is considered a single entity. So n is equal to 4. But Bobby and Malu has their own arrangement and that is 2 factorial. Therefore, P is equal to the quantity of 4 minus 1 factorial times 2 factorial. 4 minus 1 is equal to 3. So that is 3 factorial times 2 factorial. Which is P is equal to 12 ways. To wrap up, remember that in solving work problems involving permutation, we can use the following formulas. A. P is equal to N factorial divided by the quantity of n minus r factorial and that is for the linear taken r at a time b p is equal to n factorial divided by a factorial times b factorial times c factorial and so on and that is for distinguishable permutation letter c p is equal to the quantity of n minus 1 factorial and that is for the circular permutation d P is equal to the quantity of n minus 1 factorial divided by 2. That is for circular permutation without lock. And letter E, P is equal to n factorial divided by 2 for circular permutation with lock. For your valuing, you have to give your reflection in the given situation. It is in international summits that major world decisions happen because of the pandemic that we are facing at present situation. Suppose that you were the overall in charge of the sitting in an international convention wherein 12 country representatives were invited. They are the prime ministers or presidents of the countries of Canada, China, France, Germany, India, Japan, Libya, Malaysia, Philippines, South Korea, USA, and United Kingdom. What style of arrangement would you prefer? Is it linear or circular and why? Create your own seat plan for these 12 leaders based on your knowledge of their background. Discuss why you arrange them in that way. You may write your output in your reflection notebook. I know you are now ready to answer the post test. Directions. Identify what is being asked in each question. Write your answer in your paper. Number one, Cardo have six different jackets. If he cannot wear the same jacket on two consecutive days, how many different ways can he dress on Wednesday and Thursday? Is it A, 12, B, 22, C, 30, D, 36. The correct answer is letter C. Number two, seven students, including Carlo, has a picture taking. How many ways can they arrange themselves if Carlo is always at the middle? Is it A, B, C, or D? The correct answer is letter C. For number three, 15 students join a contest in the school. The contest offers first, second, and third prize. How many different combinations of first, second, and third place winners can be there? Is it A, B, C, or D? The correct answer is letter B. Number four. In how many ways can seats be chosen for 10 couples on a Ferris wheel that has 10 double seats? Is it A, B, C, or D? 
The correct answer is letter D. And the last, number five, Joanne is planting 10 colored flowers in a line. In how many ways can she plant three red flowers, four yellow flowers, and three purple flowers if the yellow flowers are placed side by side? Is it A, B, C, or D? The correct answer is letter A. Okay? Thank you guys for answering the post test. I know you are now ready to answer some activities. For activity number one, let's practice. Analyze and answer the given questions. Number three, four, and for activity number two, keep practicing. Analyze and solve what is asked in each problem. Number one. Number two. Number three. Number four. And for activity number three, test yourself. Answer what is asked in each problem. For numbers four to five, And here are the key to correction. Thank you and have a nice day.